Hello, hello, hello. All right, so we are cracking a box of Battle Bond today. Some sexy Battle Bond. Uh, I will adjust the camera so we can see all these. But uh, first thing I want to do is just go over one more time Regicide for you guys. Uh, because it is a uh, pre-order pre weekend, Regicide. This game is what you play with your EDH games, large multiplayer games. You can do anything from uh, four, six, eight, up to ten players. There's promos all over this group. Uh, Regicidethegame.com is how you can get yourself a pack. And basically, you get to have a lot of fun by changing the win conditions. No longer do you just have to win by killing everybody. Now you can win by healing permanents, being the first to die, or protecting your friends. Uh, so Regicide the Game is on pre-order right now with a discount. That's Regicidethegame.com. So next, what we're going to do, I'm going to readjust the camera. Where did my little thing go? Here it is. And we will get this box cracking underway. Thanks for joining us, and let's make this some fun. Uh, our contestants today, we have lucky number, or lucky number, lucky Trevor. All right, let's get this set up. All right. All right, all right, all right. How's everybody doing today? I hope we're having a good Passover Friday. Uh, for the non-religious folks, we just call it Friday. And as soon as I'm there, we will start us up. All right, so we have ourselves the following contestants. Trevor had one spot. Mark Racho had two spots. Chris McGlair had two, uh, a spot. And Lionel R had two spots. So I'm going to take our trusty D6 right here. And each person will get themselves an order, okay? And that will be the packs that we open for them. So Trevor is first, and this is the order we're opening for you. Trevor, number one. Trevor is number one. So Trevor will get the first six packs. Mark R. <laughs> what do you know? Number two. It's almost like it's working for me. Let's see if he gets number three as well. It is number four. So Mark R is number four after that. Chris will be what number? Six. Chris is six. So that's six right there. We still have three and let's see. One, two. I need a three and a five. Three and a five. Here we go. This is for Lionel. All right, there's, we're looking for three or five. You know what, since he's going to be either three or five, he's the last contestant, we'll just do it that way. One, two, three, and then uh, five. Okay, so the order will be Trevor, followed by Mark, followed by Lionel, uh, followed by Mark again, Lionel again, and Chris will be last at sixth place. So let's go ahead and crack ourselves a box of Battle Bond. Good luck to everybody. There's some beautiful cards in here. Uh, let us, uh, let's just take it away. This box has soared in price value. Uh, a lot of it is based on, well, just the fact that it's a good set, good box. There's not a lot of reprints that are coming out soon uh, other than Modern Horizons, and most of this will likely not be in there because it's all uh, some of this is modern pliable. All right, so let's open the box. I did like the art and the way they did all this. And there we go. Here's all the beautiful packs. And our first contestant is Trevor. I'm going to pull out six random packs. Good luck to you, Trevor. We're nervous for you too, buddy. Is there a, what do we need here? There's Miskoth Lattice. What was some of the other beautiful stuff? Doubling Season, of course, is already at $60. What else was out there? There was, uh, of course, True Name Nemesis is still a $218 foil. Najina is $90. Doubling Season Foil is $80. These are all the foils. Uh, on the non-foil side, you got Doubling Season at $60. Miskoth Lattice, whoa, there we go. Miskoth Lattice is somewhere around $30. Apologize for that little fun rude awakening. There we go. Next on live stream. Okay. So there we all are. Um, uh, let's see. Land tax was over 25. Arena Rector is 22. True name is 15. There is money to be had in these packs, and you got six of them. So best of luck to you, Trevor. Let's crack some packs. Here we go. Pack number one for you. And thanks again for participating and for uh, sponsoring the basement. We do appreciate your support. Okay. All right. Now they did these things differently. I believe the rares in the front, but let me double check here. So we got ourselves a token warrior token followed by a lance and holy shit arena rector. What a pull right off the bat. That's our mythic foil, our mythic right there. Uh, as soon as I can show you my good old focusing camera. Yep. Going to do a, going to do a wild pitch to try to actually get focus on this little piece of shit. <laughs> What is Arena Rector at? Arena's sitting at $22 right now, Chief. $22 Arena Rector. You just paid for most of uh, your, your packs right there. Nicely done. Nice pull. And we have ourselves an Intimidator 
followed by Oz, man, there's such cool value in this. Azra Oddsmaker, Hunted Wumpus. There's just cool stuff in here. And uh, if I can actually get this a little bit closer, we're not going to go through all the commons, but I will show some early commons. Goodness, this this uh, focus down in front. Come on, baby. Just once in your miserable shit life, work for me. I promise you a new camera is on the horizon, but I paid $100 for this, and I'm just a little pissed that it can't do basic things like focus. All right, just, just a quick second. Let's see. If I can do a quick second here, technical difficulties. All right, let's try this ever so differently and see if maybe, just maybe, it's the lovely background that's throwing our focus off. Sorry, guys, for the glitch. Appreciate you sticking through. Yeah, yeah, no, absolutely. That is a good call all over that. Just once would I love if this started working for me. It's not even focused on my hand. Man, God, this is just fucking awesome. There we go. Sweet Jesus Christ. Okay. So, Arena Rector. Let's open another pack because I'm already really happy about this. Okay, here's the rest of our five packs, Trevor. Let's keep on things going. All right. So let's go from the back this time, because apparently the rare is right underneath, just with all the goddamn focus. Okay, so we're going to do Expedite. I'm trying to make this work for everybody involved here, and I do apologize that, for the love of God, I cannot get focus on this camera. Impulse. Wandering Wolf. Thunderstrike. Uh, something, something. Assassinate. Gratis Matha. You guys are here for the rare. You know what? <laughs> this is an awesome box opening so far. Or a champion. And a sphinx. Now we're on to the, the uncommons. Nimbus champion. And a slum reaper. And play of the day. Play of the game. This is kind of a neat one. I like this, actually. So play of the game. Exile all non-land permanents, but it has the assist mechanic. If you haven't played with that before, it's really fun. Basically, you can have other players help you pay for the spell. And it's Exile Non-Land Permanence. So basically in an EDH game, you would say, hey, folks, uh, who wants to help me pay for this? And if they help you, then you basically get a, uh, a card cast for a lot less than it normally would be cast. Pretty sweet. That is pack number two. All right. And we're just going to keep on rocking with this kick-ass uh, focus. All right. We're going to do this from behind. Call to heal. Pierce Strider. Huddle up. Charging Rhino. Negate. Oh, sexy, sexy. Negate. Why? For the love of all that is holy. And you know what pisses me off even more? I can live stream on, or I can, my phone is a better camera than this piece of shit, right? I'm, man, aren't you guys happy you're supporting me? Uh, is a better camera than this piece of shit. Jesus Christ, wake up, but it won't let you live stream. So I could do all this and then just show you the results a la how Rudy does things. And I cannot get this thing to work for me today. It is just refusing to play ball. Oh God, please help me. Negate. All right, hose it town. We're just going for it. Trevor, you already got super value. I appreciate your patience, gentlemen. I do apologize. I, I just don't know. If anybody knows how to make focus work in the land of cameras, man, that would be super if you could tell me. And holy shit, you got a Will Kenrith, which means you also got Rowan Kenrith, which was the other big, sexy money foils right there. Oh, my God. You are kicking ass and taking names. Battle Rattle Shaman. Followed by Battle Mastery, filled with fright. Who gives a shit? You have made your money back. You've got yourself an Arena Rector, a Rowan, and a Will Kenrith. Yeah, yeah. No, Trevor, you are kicking ass and taking names, and you've only pulled three packs. you still got three to go. Not that you'll ever know these things, only because my camera is the giant fucking turd that can't take video. Because, you know, what are cameras for? Oh, God damn me. All right. Let's just continue. 
Rambo, don't you worry about it. There's a lot of good, sexy, juicy stuff in here. Okay, next round, Forest. And the big foil is Doom to Center, which is our foil. Very nice. Did we open a rare slot? Noose Graph Mob is our rare. And there's a battlefield with five 1-1 one -one counters on it. Don't worry, I'll read it for you because it's not like you can read it yourself. Whenever a player casts a spell, remove one one counter from a new scrap mob. If you do, create a 2-2 two -two black zombie creature token. That's a nice little zombie there. Soul Blade Corrupter. <sighs> Soul Blade Renewer. Unflinching Courage. Shoulder to Shoulder. Doom to Center. Claustrophobia. Seer's Lantern. Reckless Reveler. Primal Hunt Beast. Totally Lost Consulate Skygate and Lightning Talon. I think I, think I figured it out. As long as I have it literally one inch away, there's sometimes focus on this camera. All right. We're kicking ass. Okay. Trevor, man, this was a hell of a, a round for you. We got two packs left, and then we're going to move on to our next contestant. So now that we've got the focus thing figured out, let's keep on going for the gold. We're still looking for fun items such as land tax, miscal lattice, doubling season, of course, is in there, and, a, and a, very likely a foil rare, like a true name nemesis or an Arena Rector, a Miskos Lattice, a Brightling, a Land Tax, Arcane Artist, and Spellseeker. So much good value. Here we go. And da, 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 da. there it is. Okay, that's how close we're getting. Zombie, Mountain, and the rare spot, Kahoth Bright Flame. That's a nice little uh, rare for you. And is this he a partner? I believe he's a partner, which means you get the other partner. That was something really sweet about um, Battle Bond. When you got one partner, you got a second one, which means you get double your rares, which also means, everybody, there's going to be a lot of rares in this ca uh, campaign. Uh, Spectral Searchlight, nice little artifact there. Pulse of Mursa, Expedition Raptor, Hand of Silgmore, and a bunch of other commons. Very, very, very nice pulse, Trevor. Very happy for you. Congrats to you. And you've been with us for a while now, so you definitely de uh, deserve some of these great pulls. All right. Pack number six, final pack for good old Trevor. Yes, if you get a foiled uh, partner, you get the other one foiled. And there's some very, very uh, expensive foils in this set. All right, Island. And our rare slot is a foil. It's Fertilid. Nice little foil there. All right, and what is our rare slot? Boom. It looks like a Nyaxithid. Nyaxithid. Next, it enters the battlefield. Uh, choose an opponent. He gets one, minus one, minus one for each card in the chosen player's hand. Nice little rare. Fog Bank is an uncommon for us. The Horror uncommon. Assassin's Strike. And a bunch of commons for you. We're going to run through real quickly. Very, very nice pulls. This guy. Didn't this guy just become a Planeswalker? Isn't that the new one? <laughs> yeah. Isn't that kind of crazy? I think that's pretty crazy. Elvisionary Raider, Hexplate, and Battle Rempart. Trevor, my man. You've done very, very well for yourself. You got your money back and then some. Excellent, excellent pulls. Nicely done, Trevor. Let's move on to on the list we have Trevor is done. Number two is going to be Mark R for the first round. Mark R. I'm going to pull six packs for you. Best of luck to you, Mark. Here's one, two, three. Where the hell is that doubling season? I'm going to say it's right here. There's four packs, five packs, and lucky number six packs. And this is the first round for Mark Racho. Good luck to you, brother. You mix them up because it means no difference whatsoever. Thanks all for watching, participating, and putting up with my camera shenanigans. Let's open up some juicy uh, love for Mark Racho. Good luck to you, brother. All right. So we start off with a token, a forest. I see a foil. Let's see the foiling. What is it? Ooh, ooh, ooh. It keeps going. It keeps going. Morphic Pool. That's actually a pretty sweet foil. This is the uh, their way of doing a new um, uh, dual land. So basically, as long as you have, uh, if you don't know, uh, and it is foil, it's kind of hard to pick up. There we go. Um, if you don't know, as long as you have two or more opponents, it comes into play untapped. So very, very sweet. Let me just pull up a quick value on that according to TCG, Morphic Pool. Because these cards, I'm telling you, these are the new dual lands. Morphic Pool. Currently at foil. Non-foil is 14. Holy shit, that's a $40 foil for you. Mark, you can't be mad at that at all. $40 foil. We haven't even opened the foil or the raw, the rare slot. So let's check this out. Actually, let me put this bad boy also into a uh, perfect fit before we go any further. And when I do that, of course, I reveal a mystic confluence because I'm an idiot and I forgot the rare was right under nice there. Nicely done. Nice little mystic confluence for you, sir. Congratulations. Mystic is also, I believe, uh, 
a nice little card. Excellent for countering and all the other juicy stuff you'll do with that. Mystic Confluence, nice little, uh, looks like uh, about a $4 card, but awesome with its three abilities. Yeah, the royal slot is right, Chaos. Okay, so let's see the rest of our cards. We have ourselves a Fertilid. We have Reckless Scholar, a Tenacious Deed, I Blight Assassin, Light Walker, Water Forcer, and we'll just get through the rest of these commons. Excellent, excellent. So far, both patrons that have already put in have already got their money back. Already gotten your money back. Foil Mythic uh, Morphic Pool. Of course, the Arena Rector was pulled in the first one, as well as Ronin and his uh, his buddy over there. Uh, I'll get those all perfect fitted for you. But this is uh, only pack number one of Mark Rocho's pulls. Good luck to you uh, on pack number two. And hello, Killjoy. How are we doing today, boss? Pack number two, starting off with a zombie token. Followed by a forest. And our rare spot is... Wow, you're killing it with these dual lands. Very, very nice. These are awesome, man. And they only go up as this is the only set they've been printed in. Congrats to you on that one. Uh, Intimidator, Bring Down, Hunted Wumpus, Pacifism, and then a bunch of other commons. Very, very nice pulls for you. Lead by example is pretty fun. Expedite and Pierce Strider. Excellent job. Another duel, brother. Another duel. All right, pack number four. That's why this box has gone up so damn high. There's just so much value in it. I was buying these nonstop for $80, and then I turned around, and I shit you not, overnight on eBay, these things are about $180, $200 each. You can't get them cheaper than that. It's crazy. All right. Let's get a little bit of, you know what we're talking about, that old F word. There it is. And our swamp. And our foil and or rare is, holy shit, bro. Dude, uh, you're going to have some major trade bait. Or, or just if you want to be starting decks, this is the way to do it. Morphic Pool, again, $15 rare, not foil. Not foil is already $15. Uh, Charm Seeker, Goldforge Sentinel, Long Road Home, and then, of course, all the rest. Nicely done, my friend. Doing some damage there. Pack number two is down. Pack number three is down. Oh, excellent. Bra Rambo, then. This is perfect for you. All right. Back to a token, followed by an Island. Do we have a foil? Do we have a mythic? What do we have here? The winner is Virtue of the Veal, which means you also get Grom the Great. Anytime you get a legendary partner, you get the second. So that's like double your rares, double your fun right there. Nicely pulled. And we got a Rush Blade Commander. Do, 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 do. There we go. Uh, fumble, Rebuke, the whole works. And then we'll just show the rest of the commons as we've been doing. Nicely, nicely done. Excellent pulls. You are kicking ass and taking names. Uh, Mark Racho, you have made your money back and then some. Doing very well with that foil rare. Let's see if we find ourselves a mythic time. I believe you said you needed a Miskoth Lattice is what you're looking for, or doubling season. If you're rare drafting, you're already ahead of the game. What is the rare this time around? Boom. Archon of Valor's Reach. This is a baller creature. Flying Vigilance and Trample. And when he attacks, he just, uh, I believe it's Exile? Oh, no. Choose Artifact, Enchantment, Instant, Sorcerer, Planeswalker. And then the player can't cast those anymore. If you've never played with this card, this is called Control.com. Awesome. Awesome card. Actually, I don't even know why I'm not playing it. This needs to be in one of my decks. This is awesome. Uh, I love creature-based damage decks. And what do you know? I'm doing a creature tournament where you can only use creatures. And wouldn't this be entertaining if you could literally turn off... Well, I guess if only it said you couldn't play creatures, that would be ridiculously broken. <laughs> okay. Uh, and we have ourselves some uncommons. Fumble, Veteran Explorer, Loyal Pegasus, and then all the rest. Excellent. Uh, Killjoy, so I'm not sure what you're talking about. Are you talking about War of the Spark? There was a buy a box promo you I don't know what you're referencing. I don't think there was a buy a box with Battle Bond, but I could be wrong. Yeah. Um, I would not work with that vendor again. Honestly, if, if that was the whole reason, unless they never said that there was a, a, a buy a box, you know, most of the time it's only LGSs that can get you the buy a box. And then the online vendors only get the box themselves. So it depends on who you're dealing with. For example, I'm going to be buying boxes, but I don't have a vendor license, 
So I'm not getting a discount on them. I'm buying at the same price you're getting them and I won't be getting the buy box promo. So it just really depends on which avenue you're going for. Obviously, if you can support an LGS, do that. Uh, if you're if it's not within your means to do so, then try to get one online. That's the best advice I can give you. And pack number six for Mark Racho. Uh, we got a sexy emblem. Does that mean we get the second emblem? No, okay. But we have a mountain. What's underneath the mountain? Seedborn Muse. Holy shit. Now, she has gone down a little bit in value, but I mean, only monetary because this is still a must have in any set that loves to untap things, which should be anything. Uh, great, great card. If you've never played it before and you're not a green person, well, what are you doing wrong in your life? She's still 10 bucks? Yeah, still 10 bucks. This is why this set is so damn expensive. Super duper value. Nicely done, Mark. And you have another six packs coming your way too. So you can't be mad at that. Well, well played. Mark is ahead of the game. Everybody's winning so far. Trevor's ahead of the game. Uh, Mark is number two. Number three is Lionel. Hopefully Lionel is in the big board. Uh, Mark, just so you know, uh, Chaos Killer, we are all sold out on packs. So if you're tempted, I'm hoping you're tempted on something else we're doing because all the packs are already purchased. Okay, Lionel R. One, two, three, four, five, and six. All right, here is six packs. This is Lionel R, number three. Lionel, I hope you're on the board. If you're not, uh, you'll get to see this a little bit later. Best of luck to you, buddy. Yeah, it makes me want more boxes too, but they're just, man, they're pricey. All right, here we go. Starting off with a zombie. This is Lionel's first round of packs. He also got two slots or 12 packs. And do we got a foil? Do we got a, we had a foil. An Omen Speaker. All right, not bad. And how about our rare slot? Bountiful Promenade. Got himself a dual land as well. Man, that is more duels than I got, or new duels than I got to open at any point. That is awesome. And you know what? I, I So a little personal story about Lionel. Um, he previously got out of the game and is getting back into the game. So he's opening just whatever he can to try to get some value, some trade bait. And this is definitely a good set for him for that. So congrats to you, Lionel. And whether you're watching now live or whether you're going to watch a little bit later, uh, best of luck on your pulls. All right. Warrior is our token. Planes, what is our rare? Crovis Fury. I don't believe I've seen this. For each player, choose friend or foe. Each player discards. Each friend discards all cards from their hand and draws that many cards plus one. And if you choose foe, they deal damage. That is a baller card. Baller card. I love that. Okay. Gang up. Destroy target creature with power X or less. Phantom warrior. Aim high. And then the rest. Nice. Very nice. Okay. Yes, no, yeah, absolutely right. I, I I remember he played that, and I was really impressed with that card. Uh, I really like his deck, and now I have to build a deck just like it because his is pretty awesome. All right, pack number, let's see. This is pack number three for Lionel. Is land and the rare slot. Core Spirit Dancer, very nice card. Great way uh, when you're building like a, um, a strategy built around enchantments and drawing cards and things like that. Savage Vent Maw for the W. Uh, Explorer, Plated Crusher, Fan Favorite, Fan Favorite, such an awesome card. Uh, Shock, Royal Trooper, and the rest. Very nice. <laughs> All right, gentlemen, we've got two, three packs left. Here is Lionel's next one. Planes followed by Magmatic Force, beginning of each upkeep. This deals three damage to any target. Cheapers. And a Juggernaut, a Dragon Breath. Swords to Plowshares. Everybody needs some good swords love. Did you all see that new Path to Exile that's with the new alt art? That's pretty sweet. Last Grasp and Assassinate and the rest. Very nice. Yeah, yeah. I'm actually interested in maybe... Uh, I didn't care as much for the Jace. What do they call that again? It's not uh, from the vaults. It's... Um, I don't know, Mythic Timmy Edition, something, something. But, uh, yeah, the new art on those cards is pretty sweet. All right, Mirror, Island. Do we, let's see a Mythic. We haven't pulled a Mythic in a little while. Thrilling Encore. This is a sweet one. If you haven't seen this before, put into the battlefield under your control all creature cards and all gravers that were put there from the battlefield this turn. So, J Spellbook, right. So, it'll be a Gideon Spellbook. 
Um, so Thrilling Encore, for those that haven't played this before, basically what this means is someone board wipes, you play this after the board wipe, you now get all the creatures that were board wiped. <laughs> yeah, broke as fuck, and really, really fun. Uh, Chakram Retriever, Chakram Slinger, Trumpet Blast, and then the rest. All right, good value, good value, good things that we can trade for, you can build with, a lot of fun tech in these decks. All them ETBs. You're absolutely right. And pack number six for for uh, Lionel. Ooh, we've been moved. We're we're upgrading from zombie to zombie giant. That's French. And I assume it's an Island because they're always Islands. And what is the mythic spot? Goblin Raise Runners. Sack a land. Put a one one counter on Goblin Raise Runners. Beginning of your end step, you may have uh, these Raise Runners deal damage equals number of one one counters on it to target player or planeswalker. That's kind of fun. Okay, Noxious Dragon is the uncommon. Phantom Warrior, Jubilant Mascot, and then the rest. All right, not too shabby. You've got another round coming up, of course. But let's continue with the mayhem. Uh, let's see, that was Lionel. So number four is Mark Racho. We are back in the Rach. Mark Racho, next round. So we've got ourselves one, two, three. And let's pull out... Four, five, and six. Two, four, six packs. There it is. Mark Racho, round two. Come on down. Still yet to be seen. More mythics, such as, of course, Miskoth Lattice, Land Tax, um, the sexy, sexy uh, doubling season. Yeah, that's that's what we're playing for. We're playing for the biggins. All right. Oh, we moved up. Force, that's a good sign. It's no longer in Island. What is the mythic slot? Boom, evil twin. All right, that was just a fool with you. Have a little fun. Although that opportunity. There's some cool cards in here. Okay, you've seen all that, Racho. I know what you're looking for. We're rare drafting. Black Blade Reforge art is gorgeous. And I play Black Blade Reforge. Like I said, I'm thinking I'm going to crack one of these Gideon boxes. They're pretty sweet. Yeah, evil twin's not bad. There's. I want to see a clone dot deck. I really want to see that. I think that'd be a lot of fun. <laughs> that's all right trevor there's plenty to go around and we do this every friday sometimes it's a, a more expensive box like this or or a master's box or sometimes i mean you've been playing with this for a while we may do a dominaria when i get war of the spark we will definitely be cracking war of the spark i'm just trying to get it at a reasonable price because I'm, I'm i don't have any discounts all right <laughs> right okay warrior is our token followed by a forest and come on show us some love here is it a lattice? Is it a paradox engine? It is foil. It is. Ooh, <laughs> I just bring that back. This is what I saw. <laughs> and we all got real excited for a foil lattice. Millennial gargoyle is a foil, but do we have something sexy underneath? Let's find out. No whammy, no whammy, no whammy. Mind blade render. What's this do? Whenever your opponents are dealt combat damage, if any of that damage was dealt by a warrior, you draw a card and lose one life. Interesting. Okay. Flame, uh, oops, sorry about the focus. Flame Weaver Invoker, Kiss of the Amisha, Decorated Champion, and then all the rest. Okay. That is pack number, let's see. Do, 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 do. One, two, three, four. Uh oh, I brain farted. One, two, three, four. Oh, that's two packs. <laughs> I just kept them right here. I was wondering what was going on. All right. Well, this is pack number three for Mark Racho in his second slot. Good luck to you, Mark. Zombie. Planes. What is the foil? Uh, Lionel, we're going to um, – your. I'm glad you're in. Uh, you did not get the foil luxury suite. You did get some lands, some dual lands, and you've got another slot coming up at the end of this. So uh, just stay tuned in the live stream, and then you can watch it again when we, re you know, on repeat. Okay, so planes and the uh, we're in Mark Racho's openings right now. All right, so planes and oh, there's the Miskoth lattice. That's the one he wanted. Booyah! Kapow. Nice pull, Mister Racho. Nicely done. Blaring recruiter, blaring captain. You don't care about the rest. You got exactly what you wanted. Foil and the lattice. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Doing well. <laughs> Glad I could help you, brother. Yeah. Yeah, so um, Mark is talk chaos killer is talking about a vandal blast. We had an epic game of um, regicide, which uh, you know, quick impromptu plug regicide. Get your pre order now. Um, 
and and he basically miscoth lattice everybody's board state and then went for the vandal blast it didn't go off but it would have been ridiculous had it it was pretty awesome good move i i really appreciated that all right pack number shit four i think we're on to we got ourselves a nice little emblem and let's get that in focus so when we pull our next rare i mean racho you're just you're just playing for for fun at this point because you're already ahead of the game uh swamp and angelic chorus okay the crowd goes wild. I love some of these things. Support X. Each creature with a 1-1 counter on it gains trample within a turn. And it's got the assist mechanic, so you can put it on all the different players. Uh, Enduring Scale Lord, Inner Demon, Hand of Slimmer, all that stuff. Uh, let's see. And I was playing 3v1. Yeah, we're, it kind of was. The, the crowd did go wild. It was super sweet. All right, Mr. Racho, two packs left. I mean, you've already been to the mountain. You've seen all the goodies. Paradox Engine, I guess, is really all that you're looking for at this point. Maybe some shiny foil. Uh, let's get this in here. Mirror, Mountain, and Spellseeker. Another excellent card. Spellseeker for the W. What's this? Sitting at around 15 or so? Holy shit. The value in this set is redunculous. Um, I don't have the exact numbers on me right now, but it's, it's not bad at all. And a great, great card. Good pull. Uh, Karametra's Fervor, whoop, do boo Favor, Trumpet Blast, Jubilant Mascot, Grotesque Mountain, and Aura Champion, and all the rest. Man, you are doing gangbusters right now, Racha. All right, last pack for the win. Yeah, this is a great set. And Lionel, you didn't even get to see your pulls yet, and we still got pulls for you to come. All right, Beast Time, Forest, and what is the next card? luxury suite because if you just can't do any better this is we're killing it we're absolutely killing it another one th this is what you got a, a couple of too as well lionel uh this is the, the the new dual lands that basically come into play untapped as long as you're playing edh and a paragon drake enthralling victor man yeah you are you are just ahead of the game doesn't really matter what we put in there racho aces aces brother everybody has gotten some value out of this so far uh trevor racho lionel Okay, so Mark, you are done. Mark Racho is done. We are on to opening number five. So opening number five on the list is Chris. Chris got ourselves one spat, one uh, slot, which is six packs. So let's crack some packs, and then the rest will be Lionels. So we're going to do it like this. Two, four, six, just like that, all right? Odds, evens. Odds, evens. Lionel, since you're here, uh, and I think this is your first time playing, Go ahead and say odds or evens, and whatever the die pulls up, odds or evens, that's how we're going to divide it. So write odds or evens, Lionel, if you could. Of course, if you just went to take a shit right now. <laughs> evens, of course. Okay, so odds, evens. Here we go. Oh, wait, what does it matter? He just said evens. I don't even need to roll. <laughs> he just said evens. <laughs> All right, so odds are going to my friend Chris. Good luck to you, Chris. May the force be with you and all that jazz. <laughs> I don't know what I was rolling for. <laughs> Sometimes I get a little punch drunk doing this kind of stuff because, I mean, even though I'm not getting the cards, it's super fun to open them. All right. Thanks for all watching and, and playing along. Spirit is our first card. Let's pull some goodies for Mr. Chris. All right. Here it is. We got ourselves a planes. And da, 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 da. doubling season for the W power move. Chris, you better be in on this. Holy shit. That is a $60 doubling season. Booyah. I need to have some kind of like something like sparks and flames and shit go off. God mode. in. I mean, do you need to open the rest? You killed it. Is Chris live right now? Please tell me you're in, in the chat. Oh, my God. That's the one. And God, this art is just fantastic. Look at this beautiful art. I know. I Honestly, I'm not going to lie to you. This is like a $400 box. I wish I'd kind of kept it myself. There's stupid value in this box. Wow. Oh, I just have to look at that a little longer. Oh, my God. I never got to crack one of these, and I really, really wanted one. Wow, Chris. I hope you find good use out of this. This is yours, brother. Nicely done. Does it matter what else we pull at this point? I mean, you've paid for your packs. Wow, doubling season. Okay. Morbid curiosity. Uh, spell snare, take up arms, fan favorite, and the rest. Let me uh, let me get that sixty dollar doubling season into a perfect fit for you, buddy. And I'll get the other rares that you guys pulled uh, into perfect fits as well before I send them off. Wow, that is oof. 
Engaged, good sir. Engaged. Nicely done. Man, I hope he's watching and just laughing his ass off. Are you Killjoy? Is that who you are, Chris? Oh, goodness. All right. Uh, that was pack one. <laughs> I know. There can still be foils and rares in here. Yeah. All right. Rock and roll, guys. Um, I mean, it, you know, it's, oh, you know, so here's the thing. I did say choose odds or evens <laughs> for poor Lionel. And he's probably the one who's kicking himself more than anything at this point. <laughs> oh, my God, Lionel. Uh, we're going to open some good stuff for you too, buddy. But damn, that was a good pull. Okay, here we go. Uh, Warrior, Planes. Boom, foil chain lightning. Look at that sexy. And a vigor. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. There is so much value in these packs. This is stupid. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, my God. You know what? Maybe he will. Wow. I'm uh, really kind of kicking myself for not opening this myself. <laughs> oh, my God. This is great. All right. Beast mode. A mountain and magmatic force followed by all the rest. I mean, at this point, we're just goofing off. The foil chain lighting is gorgeous. Gorgeous cards. <laughs> Lionel, there's got to be something amazing for you. We're going to find it. Don't worry. We're still on Chris right now because after that doubling season, we don't really know what else to do. <laughs> like, that was the money. All righty. Uh, I mean, there's still land taxes. There's still a lot of good stuff to be open. Okay. Da, 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 da. Sea of Clouds. Have we opened all of these at this point? I know I've seen four, maybe five, including the foil. Holy shit. I opened, I think, one of these, and I opened about seven or eight boxes on my own. This is crazy. Oh, my God. How do they let a box like this leave? So much flipping value that you can't see because everything's in, in screw you mode as far as my camera goes. Uh, focus down in front, down in front. There it is, kind of. Oh, my God. Kill this camera. Uh, Fairver sorts the plowshares and the rest. Oh, my God. This is awesome. <laughs> Can't get that at Target. <laughs> you still have two packs left, Chris. We've been on you for so long. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's so much fun. All right. Uh, zombie. Come on, baby. Focus. Come on, baby. Light my fire. True Name Nemesis would be outrageous at this point. Um, a camera that focus would also be much loved. Mountain and do we have a foil? Do we have a rare? Do we have something shimmy shimmy cocoa pop? It is pier! Booyah! Which also means Toothy is right there. Chris, for the love of God, get onto this live stream and comment. You are getting so much fucking value right now. I'm losing it. Holy shit! Yeah, you get one, you get the other. This is a ridiculous set. Oh my god. Oh, I got to find more boxes of this. I don't know if we'll be able to top it, but jeepers, creepers. All right, last pack, man. Lionel, dude, I I hope you find a way to top all this because you got six packs left. Here we go. Last of Chris's packs. Planes, and it looks like a legendary guafa. And chain lightning and the rest. It doesn't matter. You've already killed it. Crushed it. Oh, this box is sick. Okay, here we go. Lionel, my friend, you pulled and said these packs. These were the packs you requested. Now, you already have, uh, let's see, Lionel, you were opening number three. So you already have this over here, this pile right here. Okay, buddy? Uh, but these are the last packs of the box, by the way. All right? And these, uh, all these uh, will get sent out either Monday or Tuesday, as I normally do, and I'll send you confirmation uh, when they get sent out. Uh, and if you pick up, then, you know, I've got it here. Uh, okay, so best of luck to you. I think we're all excited to see if there's any other sexy love in here. True name is still possible. Uh, foil mythic is possible. Um, you know, land tax would be nice to see. There's still a lot of value left. Best of luck to you, Lionel. Let's do it. You ready? You're psyched? Me too, buddy. Let's do it. Booyah. Lionel round two starts with a beast and a swamp. And the rare slot is... Let's get focus so we do it all at the same time. Don't fuck with me now. Diabolic Intent, not bad. Nice little tutor there. So if you haven't used this before, I mean, Diabolic Intent, you basically get the tutor for whatever you want. Awesome card. Chain Lightning, Steep Glider, 
veteran explorer and the and the commons very very nice okay yeah tutors are great especially for a man who plays what is your main deck your dragon deck your uh what the hell is it called who knows the the name of uh, uh what does he play lionel the um kalia thank you yes tutors are i'm sure you realize amazing in kalia all right starting off with ourselves a warrior token waiting on the focus oh my god kill this kid Forest. Oh, do I see a foil? Is that a foil or something? No, not a foil, but it looks looks like it's a Sentinel Tower. Okay. All right. Not too bad. Some cool effects there. Kind of fun. And to protege, proud mentor, beast within. Good value there. Screeching buzzard, tandem tackets, and the rest. Okay. Kalia, let's find you some, some beautiful. I feel like, you know what? We're going to save this one for later. This one. This one needs to get open right now. These two. These two. God, they look like Cersei Lannister and her brother, right? Do you think they're doing it? All right. By the way, if anybody's local and watching, we, of course, will be doing another episode of Game of Thrones this Easter Sunday. And it was super fun last Sunday when we all got to watch together. It just gives it kind of that stadium feel where people laugh and they 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 shout at the screen. And when things are going crazy or whatever, you get that impact. It's super fun. Yeah, you have some new commander decks coming. There's no doubt. All right, Warrior is our token, Island, and show me true name, show me true name, show me worst. Oh, what does this do? Whenever, hold on, let's get in focus. Whenever an opponent taps a land for mana, tap all lands that player controls. Holy shit, if a creature an opponent controls attacks, all creatures that opponent control attack if able. Damn, that's a, you and your brother who love stacks and people. That's going to be crazy. Switcheroo, Angel of Retribution, Thrasher Brute. And fill with fright, pacifism, and all the rest. Super value there. Very nice. <laughs> is it really? Is that that couldn't be banned? Is it? What's the name? Somebody look this up. What is this card again? I've never, I've never seen it before. Wars Toll. I can't imagine they just posted something in in Battle Bond that got uh, banned already. If anybody wants to look that up, that's a super cool card though. All right, next up, pack number four. Last of the packs of Battle Bond of a God Box. Ooh, our first Mir token. Hopefully that is a good sign of things to come. Here we go. Plains is the card underneath. Show me a foil. Show me a foil true name nemesis for the $200 Wazoo. Is it foil? No, it looks green. Could it be another Dublin Z? Greater good. Another good card. Yeah, it fell a little bit, but still super value. And since they are not reprinting this, this is going to only go up. Sack a creature, draw three cards, equal to sack creature's power, then discard three. Nice card. Very, very cool. I play in several of my decks. Solemn Offering, Azra Oddsmaker, Cheering Fanatic, Assassinate, and all the rest. Very, very nice pull. Wars of Tola is legal. That's awesome. Thank you, Trevor. Okay. Here we go. Final two packs for Lionel and for the box. This is such a great box. I know everybody's super excited. I'm drawing out the anticipation. Mountain and show me foil, show me foil, show me. That's uh, foil, it's foil. Show me, uh, show me that dream. It's foil. It looks, it looks, I don't know. It's kind of either artifact or blue. Let's keep, let's go this way. Uh, ah. Oh, <laughs> Sears Lantern. <laughs> Shit, that really looked blue. All right, what is the rare slot? Boom, Najila, the Blade Blossom, legendary creature. There's your Wooberg right there. Whenever it attacks, and it's mythic, whenever it attacks, you uh, have its controller 1-1 one, one white warrior creature token. Untap all attacking creatures. They gain trample, lifelink, and haste until end of turn. Sorry, you can't see that, guys. Uh, let me show you the abilities. There it is. A shitload of stuff. An awesome, awesome commander if you've never seen this before, especially for guys who like red. Chakram Retriever, Chakram Slinger, Noxious Dragon, and Eye Blight Assassin and the rest. Very, very cool. The final pack, I pulled this out specifically to be pulled last. Please, let's have some crazy value for Lionel. Thank you all very, very much for playing today. We do this every Friday here at the Basement Games, and uh, best of luck to you. Here we go. Another mirror. Followed by an Island. And what is our rare slot? 
Last one standing. Choose a creature at random, then destroy the rest. Boom, sorcery for three. And Oracle's Insight, Blood Feud, Genesis Chamber, Shambling Ghoul, Augur Spree. It's all in there. Congratulations. Uh, yes, off of this, Akalia Colors. Blech. Gentlemen, those are your packs. Thank you all very much for playing. Don't forget one last plug. Regicide pre-order is going on now for a discount until Sunday. That's the last day you can get it at the pre-order price. Make sure you check it out, regicidethegame.com. Thank you all for playing. We're going to be having a tournament coming up in two weeks at the at the basement. We've got raffles coming back in two weeks. We've got War of the Spark coming in two weeks. And, of course, we're going to keep going on with our shenanigans. Thank you all very, very much. I appreciate you playing today. Have a great day. Happy Friday.